Hi guys, uh, my name is Chuck. I just wanted to uh, take you guys on my journey with TRS. Uh, my wife had actually started back in September, shortly after uh, she had given birth. And I started a couple weeks after her. I grew up in a military style family home with my dad and my brother. Um, my dad, he smoked a lot, a lot. Uh, so I was subject to that inside the home any of the car rides, uh, basically the only time it was, there was no smoking was when I was outside or at school. I wanna say like most other high school students, I had tons of energy, uh, played lots of sports and lots of clubs. Um, it just felt really good. Then going to my mid 20s um, or 20s, uh, college, probably eating a lot of uh, unhealthy foods, a lot of fast foods I was living off of, um, starting to just not really be as active as I once was. Um, and now in my 30s, uh, you know, kind of lethargic, uh, tired, not focusing uh, like I used to. A lot of foggy um, memories, you know, not really remembering things long term. And, you know, we did just have a baby. Um, granted, that does take away some of your energy. And it was a big gap. Um, our first two kids were about three years apart. And our newest child is five years apart from our youngest. So quite a bit of time gap in there. And uh, I've forgotten what it was like uh, to, uh, to be a new dad to, or to be a dad again. And, you know, it's some of the sleepless nights. The energy's just sapped. Um, lethargic, like I was mentioning before even starting to get achy joints. Um, my muscles were getting sore when I wasn't even using them, which I thought was really odd. So we thought we'd look up some of these symptoms and when we put them all in, heavy metal toxins had come up. Um, I displayed quite a few symptoms of the effects. We came across TRS, uh, reading a lot of testimonials about it and people were just raving on what it was doing for them. So we thought we would go ahead and give it a try. My wife started taking it first, as I mentioned before. I followed a couple weeks shortly after. Um, you know, in the beginning, I didn't notice anything right away. But as time went by, you know, one month, uh, two months, I felt a difference. So one, me being tired, not saying that went away completely, but I had some newfound energy that just came out of nowhere wasn't really doing anything else different so the only other thing that I added in was the TRS. So I was super stoked about that um, because I could actually move around uh, without feeling tired all the time. Uh, the second thing would be the achy joints and the sore muscles pretty much dissipated. I would get the achy joints especially early in the morning and that is gone now. Uh, the other thing would be my memories improving a little bit better. I am re remembering things from a longer time frame. Um, things seem to be a little bit more clear as well, uh, which ends up being the third eye or your pineal gland. Um, the fog is, is lifting, thank goodness, um, and things are, like I said, uh, becoming clear. And my focus is uh, that much sharper. I started off with a couple sprays a uh, day, I would generally do it in the morning, uh, right when I woke up, and then I would drink water um, just to make sure that it, I hydrate. Uh, and then as time went on, um, I actually bumped it up pretty quickly, I would say to about three sprays a day, um, right after the first month. Uh, right now, I'm currently on about four sprays a day, uh, and everything is just improving. Heavy metal toxins are everywhere, on this, everywhere from the air that we breathe, the water that we drink, uh, the synthetic furniture, even some clothing uh, carries this. And once these toxins enter our body, these heavy, heavy metal toxins, uh, they essentially just float around. And these heavy metal toxins, they generally will go towards fattier parts of the body, such as the brain, um, which is one of the scariest places to accumulate the heavy metal toxins. Heavy metal toxins will either stick to the zeolite, um, which is in the TRS, or they will be pulled inside the zeolite cage, 
Um, and since the zeolite is actually, uh, it's nano-sized, it's actually attached to a water molecule, um, which basically means that the water can travel anywhere inside the body where there is water. And since we're primarily made up of water, it's pretty much traveling everywhere through. So this, what's let, this is what enables um, the zeolite to access the brain and gather up the heavy metal toxins there. Now, once it is attached to the zeolite cage, uh, whether it be pulled inside or just stuck slash bonded, um, at that point we can excrete um, these heavy metal toxins uh, since they are now on the water molecule. Once zeolite has either attracted or bonded with the heavy metal toxins, uh, clearly they are still toxic. Uh, but what TRS has done is that uh, it actually will neutralize those toxins. Um, so when they are excreted out of the body, they won't cause any further damage, uh, which is huge because you don't want to pull these heavy metals out of your body and then it causes more damages is coming out. TRS actually comes out of your system in about six hours. It actually comes through means of any way that water leaves the body, such as sweating, uh, urination, or even fecal matter, just to name a couple of them. And what's really cool about this is that your body can detox to a certain extent. Uh, TRS takes it to the next level and actually helps reduce the stress placed on certain body parts, such as your liver, your kidneys, and other body systems. Um, since the heavy metals are being neutralized, that's, and they're easier to pass through your body, that's what makes or reduces the amount of stress on those body parts as well. While I am feeling better, my whole body feels better, uh, there's a little bit more mental clarity there. Uh, clearly I'm gonna continue this as, as my journey, I feel like is still gonna continue. Uh, and with everything out there, you know, from the air that I mentioned that we're breathing, uh, that's loaded with chemicals now, um, unfortunately, even the water and, you know, pretty much everywhere around us, uh, we have some sort of toxins or chemicals that are floating around. So uh, even when I do feel well, you know, I'll still continue taking the sprays. Um, I'm sure at one point I may reduce the amount, um, but for you, you know, if you are feeling good, um, then slow down. You know, you don't need to take your four or five sprays a day or whatever you're up to. I'd maybe just drop it down, you know, minimize it and then you know continue from there and just take it day by day